Hey, what's up, everybody? This is James from My Lens. Well, I had a blast. <laughs> if you ever have a chance, if you're a videographer and you do weddings and stuff like that, if you ever have a chance to do a Palestinian wedding, <laughs> Matt, do a Palestinian wedding um, because man, I had a blast at this wedding. So uh, let me tell you a little bit about, you know, about this wedding, what all I did. Well, actually, it really wasn't a wedding. It was um, a wedding party because they already got married down in Florida. So, but they wanted to have their wedding party here, you know, around fa uh, friends and family. So, although it might be a little bit challenging because uh, I think I've only done one reception wedding before. And that's when I first started out. So it would be something a little bit new for me. So anyways, I went ahead and did that. I did, I thought this was going to be something real simple, quick, not too, not too hard or anything like that. Uh, no, nah, <laughs> it was a lot of work. Yeah, believe me, it was a lot of work. Uh, but again, like I said, it, it, was, uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, first, I went to the uh, groom's house and... Um, Took some pictures there, um, some um, some uh, um, some video, and, um, and then uh, I was, they was also there getting their haircuts and stuff like that too, getting ready and stuff. After they finished getting ready, they um, they started partying. They had like a little boom box there, and they just started partying. Uh, I started in, in the room where they were getting ready. That was just a startup party. Then they went outside in the driveway, and man, did they really party out there. Oh man, they were pretty wild. You know, you can check this video out. So, after they was done with that, uh, we went ahead and went to the Embassy Suites because that's where they was uh, having their reception or their wedding party. And I went ahead and got set up, put my camera on a tripod. Uh, well, I put a, not my actual camera, the camera I have with me, I have on a gimbal, but I also put a camera up on the tripod just to capture a wide view of everything just so nothing will be missed. And, um, and that's something that they requested as well. And uh, and then I also had a camera on me to capture everything as I'm walking around and stuff like that. Uh, so anyways, um, I thought I had my lights and everything like I said, which I really didn't need no lights. I thought maybe, maybe I need the lights just in case they turned down the lights. They never turned on the lights, they just left it on. Groom and the bride, they finally arrived in, a, in their vehicle. Once they arrived, man, they started partying. It was a blast. Then from there, they they continue reporting all the way down the hallway into the reception area. Once they got in the reception area, they were still partying. Yeah, you know, they they party all the way in there. Uh, and then uh, once they got in there, they were still partying. They party for uh, for a little bit, and then finally, you know, everything calmed down. They went ahead and ate and everything. But after eating. Party was back on, and man, did they party. I mean, they kept that energy going for hours and hours and hours and hours. And did I mention for hours? And I tell you, I was actually tired of filming. I actually got tired of filming, and I don't normally get tired of filming, but I was actually tired of filming. My arms got tired and everything. I had to, I had to take it off the gimbal there for a little bit and switch it to the monopod because I, I needed, my arms needed a rest because I was super tired. Luckily, I have a really good model pod that goes pretty high, so uh, that that uh, that was really helpful. One great big party, and I'm telling you, I had a blast. 
I really enjoyed uh, enjoyed this wedding. Uh, it was a lot of fun. Uh, the music was really loud. Those uh, those drum beats when they was uh, beating on the drum and stuff like that. You, I mean, I, you felt it in your chest, <laughs> you know. So uh, that was pretty cool. But anyhow, uh, that's it for this video. I just want to pretty much talk about that and uh, tell you about my experience doing a Palestinian wedding. You know, I like all kinds of different styles of weddings. You know, it doesn't matter what style it is. It could be country, it could be city, uh, it could be a documentary style. It doesn't really matter. I enjoy doing weddings and I love doing different style weddings. So that's all I have today. And until next time, peace out and live long and prosper. I'm gonna go to the house, 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 I